we present unsupervised learning of robust spectral shape matching. We consider shape matching as the task of finding correspondences between two non-rigidly deformed 3D shapes in the form of triangle meshes. To visualize correspondences, we transfer color and or texture from one shape to the other. Many successful deep shape matching methods rely on a common functional map pipeline to compute correspondences between shapes. The pipeline consists of a feature extractor to compute vertex-wise features for both input shapes. Additionally, a functional map solver is used to impose feature preservation as well as structural properties on the problem. The functional map is used during training time for loss computation. During test time, correspondences between both shapes can be recovered from the functional map by using off-the-shelf post-processing methods. This common deep shape matching pipeline was first proposed by Litani et al. Later, it was adapted by Donati et al. as well as Rufus et al., which both achieve good performance on near isometric pairs but struggle in more challenging scenarios. For example, in the case of non isometric deformed shapes, shapes with topological noise. and partial shapes. We overcome the limitation of such challenging scenarios by explicitly considering the relationship between functional map and point map. To this end, we keep the components of the common deep shape matching pipeline and add an additional point map computation module. Herein, point maps are computed upon feature similarity. The computed soft point map can be converted to a functional map by using eigenfunctions of Laplacian matrices of shapes M and N. The resulting functional map is used in our coupling loss term. We expect that the functional map predicted by the functional map solver and the functional map predicted based on similarity of features should be similar. During test time, we directly use the point map to compute matchings between both shapes. Explicitly modeling this relationship between function map and point map leads to state-of-the-art matching performance and makes our method remarkably robust in challenging scenarios like underlined shapes, non-isometric deformed shapes, shapes with topological noise, anisotropic mesh shapes, as well as partial shapes. To showcase the performance of our method, we transfer texture from one shape to the other shape via the matching computed with our method. Furthermore, we use our method on motion sequences of the forming things 4D dataset and match every frame to its successor, which allows us to propagate coloring from the first to the last frame. We can see that our method is able to compute temporal matchings without explicitly considering time. Thank you for watching.